Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Active Webcast and in today's video demonstration, we are going to see how to map a network drive in Windows 10 computer. In order to access shared network resources more efficiently, you can create a shortcut to a folder shared by another PC or device on the network. The process for creating this type of shortcut is called mapping a network drive. When you map a network drive, it will show up as a new drive under this PC in File Explorer. So you can quickly access the shape files you need just like you would access on your local hard drive. So in this video, we will see the steps for how to make that network drive shortcut in Windows 10. A map network drive has a certain characteristics like it has a drive letter assigned like any other partition in your system. It points to a network share folder and the last but most important, you need the appropriate credential to connect to it. Let's see the demonstration. Already, I created a one share folder on the virtual machine that running on a Windows Server 2012 R2 and the name of the share folder is share1 and the IP address of the remote computer is 192.168.1.2. Now let's start the demonstration. First of all, you have to open a file explorer. Once you open a file explorer, click on this PC and now click on computer and here you can see the options to map network drive. Click on it and select map network drive. This will open another wizard. Now select the drive letter you want to use for the network folder and then click on browse. Select the computer on which you create a shared folder. In our demonstration, I create a shared folder on this computer. Let's expand it and it will ask for the credential. Let's specify the user credential. Okay, and as you can see, there is a one share folder named share one. Click on OK and here we have another option connect using different credential. So if you want to connect this share folder by using a different credential that time you can select the checkbox. Now here we have another box reconnect at sign in. You can choose to reconnect to the folder every time you sign in so it's always available to you. And now let's click on finish to create a map drive. Initially this will open the map drive once. Let's click on close to close this. Now as you can see. We have a new drive letter under this PC and that is drive letter Z. And now we will be able to access its content just like we would accessing any other folder on our computer. Okay, let's come back to the this PC and this is the way how we can create a map drive in a Windows 10 computer. We have another method to create a map drive and that is by using command. If you want to create a map drive by using command, that time you have to run the command net use then specify the drive letter let's specify drive letter y and then next you have to specify the unc path of your remote computer in our case it will be 2k12 r2 hyphen evil and then specify the name of your share folder in our case it will be share one once you specify the path of remote share folder then hit enter as you can see the command completed successfully and under this pc you can see we have another map drive with drive letter Y. So this is the second method by using command line utility net use. We can also create a map drive. And if you want to disconnect the uh, map drive at any time, that time you just have to right click on it and select disconnect. Now the map drive will not available under your PC. I want to show you one more thing. Let's close this and let's sign out from our computer. Sign out. Let's log into our computer as our user Moinher. Now, once you log in, you can see there is a message saying could not reconnect all network drive. Click on it. This will open the uh, this PC, and as you can see on our map drive, we have a symbol with cross. That means we are not able to access the shared folder, and that's why our map drive is not connected. The simple reason is the user credential. Let's double click on it and it will ask for specifying a network credential. Let's specify the user credential of our user administrator and his password Then hit enter. And that's it. Now you can see the sample file is there and now you can see same drive is available under this PC. So this is the way how we can create a map drive on Windows 10 computer.